Welcome back, everybody, to 7 Days to Die on Alpha 21 Experimental. I'm an old guy gaming, and we are picking up pretty much right where we left off. Uh, let's check this car. There's nothing there that we want. And uh, we'll try this. There's nothing there that we want. And all right, here we go. Now, now we got an orange pickup truck. Look at that. This is... We're not taking any of that stuff. Uh, this is a clear quest. It's, a, it's only a tier one. But it is a new tier one we haven't done yet. So let's check it out. Um, it doesn't look familiar to me either. Like, I mean, it doesn't look like it's uh, based off of an original POI. Like some of them are. So uh, maybe it is. I'm not sure. I just don't recognize it. So we'll see how things go here. He did. Gonna be somebody in that closet there. Oh. <laughs> oh, big guy. Okay. Check this cabinet. Uh, we will take that. And we got some trash in here. You know what? Screw it. It's just easier to do it this way. Uh, we'll take the spring. Water. Taters. What's taters, precious? I know that was terrible. Absolutely atrocious. We got a laundry room in here. We all scrap those. Take that. Oh, we're going to have to climb up that. But before we do, let's just check in here. We got a. Oh. Where's that coming from? Oh, in here. Whoop. She came out of the closet. Nice. We got ourselves a desk pistol now. So we have purse pistols, toilet pistols, and desk pistols. I don't remember the last time I found a pistol in a desk in seven days to die. I think that used to happen a really long time ago, but uh, yeah, it's uh, been some time since that, since that happened. I guess we're not supposed to open that door. Well, that door's locked too. Okay, let's climb up the rope here into the attic. Nothing over that way. Dude, what's up with the Hawaii Five O's in this house? That's two of them. Thank God they're not feral. All right, we're supposed to drop down there apparently, but let's get the this first. Seems to me like we've read a lot of medical magazines in this playthrough so far. Not a bad thing, just seems like more of those than anything else. And we are finished. Check the books. I already know that, whatever it is. And ammo pile. Nice. Always happy to get to steel um steel arrowheads. Take all of that stuff. Whoa, where are you going, Bo? He just like walked right in here. Is there anything in the backyard? Door's locked. Oh, 
Oh yeah, look at this. A little shed back here. With more stuff. All right, let's go do our trade into wrecked. Oh, I wonder if this guy reset too. Probably did. Uh, nope, it didn't. Okay, I guess it's not considered part of this property. We'll do our turn in direct, and then we're going to go do our uh, our second tier three infestation back in our own town. So I'll see you guys back there. Well, I'll see you guys at wrecked first, though, for the turn in. Can I lighten that backpack up for you? I think we'll... Mm, you know what? Let's take some Molotovs, actually. I think we'll do that. We're going to need to get rid of that first, though. Okay. We'll take... Um, let's take this I job. I like you. But maybe I'll Wengo change my mind. Barndo. Well, good luck. By the looks of it, you're gonna All right, we'll have to come back and do that because I, I really want to do this next tier three infestation. All right, so I'm going to go home, drop stuff off, get a little bit better prepared. I'll meet you guys over at the tier three infestation quest. All right, guys, I lost track of the time. Um, it's actually probably uh, almost certainly too late for us to start that quest because we're still not even back in our own town. So um, let's go ahead and do this cop car here real quick. And then I'll probably just meet you guys at the quest location in the morning. And we'll just pick it up from there. Okay, so can we grab all of that? Everything except for the water. You know we're not going to be leaving water behind, so I think what we'll do is we will give up. Ooh, let's just ditch these two cornmeals, I think. Yeah, we'll ditch the two cornmeals. Check this ambulance, too, since it's right here. With some plastic. All right. Okay, see you guys in the morning. All right, guys, it is uh, the morning of day 27, and we're ready to start uh, the McMillan Residence. I do definitely recognize this PO. I've done it many times. I just didn't know it was called the McMillan Residence. Uh, so, yeah, this is Tier 3 Infestation. I spent the night mining, and uh, we got another level, and I put that level in Physician. This is actually really good in Alpha 21 because we get 25% more health over time. Um, but we, but splints and casts will also instantly cure sprain. So that's new. It didn't used to be that way. So really cool. Uh, okay. Let's, uh, let's just go ahead and get started with this. I'm not going to worry about double loading or anything like that. And, um, yeah, this is going to be interesting for sure. There's usually a couple Zeke's in this first room here. So hopefully we don't get it. Oh my God. That many already. This is not good start. Not a good start. We got a feral and a biker. All right. We're not screwing around with these guys, especially this guy here. Okay, you're a feral big mama. Let's see if we can spear you to save some ammo, though. Try to keep from having you hit us. Whew, she tough. All right. So, we got through the very first part of it. We've got to be getting close to getting to the top of the food chain. Uh, or food, uh, well, yeah, food chain or whatever. Food tier. Line. Look at that. Grandpa's learning a lecture. Let's look at that real quick. I'm just curious. We've got to be getting close. So, if we go here. Yeah, we have 10, ten more magazines. And... Um, We'll be done. We'll be able to make spaghetti and gumbo. We can already make such good food that uh, food is definitely no longer an issue for us. Not in the least. That's actually an upgrade from what we're wearing. We're wearing a green one. Modify. Let's pull these two guys off. 
Uh, I don't have any scrap iron to repair that for now, so that gives us a third slot too that we can put something else in later. And we'll sell this. Okay, cool. We'll take it. Soup stock. That is used in a recipe, so we're going to keep that. Just you? Oh, shit. Nope, not just you. Have you guys noticed that Zombos at Alpha 21 give criticals a lot more easily than they used to? Oh, come on, man. All right, well, let's uh, take a honey. And uh, this sprain should be cured by taking this. Yeah, it's a beautiful thing. Okay. Dang. <laughs> that hurt. All right. Is there anybody in here? Doesn't the floor fall out in this, though? Or am I thinking of something else? Purple dye. Um, how about if we make our knife purple? Because why not? Modify. Hmm. It's kind of more lavender, I guess, than purple, but whatever. It works. Uh, okay, so... I'm going to do something here. Yeah, that's what I thought. I'm going to open this up if for no other reason, so I remember that that's bad juju. Let's uh, reinforce that. Let's reinforce that so we have a place to retreat to if we have to. Nope, that's not what I meant to do. Okay. Everybody loaded? We need to... Well, no. We don't need to start using our pistol because it ain't going to do any good until we put perk points into it. This is an undead legacy. I wish, though, that this game would allow us to learn by doing. I really do, but it doesn't work that way, so it is what it is. That was a lot of zombos. None of them were um, particularly nasty, though. The soldier was the worst of them, but he was normal. So, there you go. All right. A liquor pile. That's new. Murky water in a liquor pile. Okay. If you say so. Uh, we have... In my mind that I mind in last night, in my mind that I mind in, okay, um, I found a nitrate, a lead, and an iron vein. It's going, man, if I could find a coal vein, this would be like the perfect mine, but I didn't find any coal. All right. Let's be careful. Okay. We get something seriously nasty coming through there. That's going to stop them for, oh, a half a second, maybe. But it will buy us a half a second, maybe. Okay. Now, let's see. Yeah, I was going to say, I think something comes down from the ceiling there. 
So again, I'm not sure what we're dealing with. So let's do a wood block. There we got four zombies, whatever they are. And one of them's feral. Okay. I'm not screwing around with this man. No siree. Good golly, Miss Molly. <laughs> man. All right. Yeah, we definitely should have put a cobblestone block down there, but you know what? We survived it, so. Barely. Barely. Oh, uh, man. Okay. I'm going to take one of these because, uh, or for the health, rather. Even though we're not that hungry. Okay, so we got uh, everybody out of here. Is there anything up here? Uh, e e uh, no, I don't think so. No, okay. It's just is the little entryway there. Yes, see what I see? There's a duffel bag up there. Uh, we can't pull up there with these guys in the way, though, so maybe we'll check that out later. Clear in this room. Is it there dogs in here? Glad he wasn't feral. Machine guns, harvesting tools. Chicken soup. We'll sell those. Where? Where, where, where? I don't even know where that's coming from. Outside, maybe? Yeah, we'll take that stuff. Let's actually go back in here for a moment. Good one. I was trying to get that duffel bag. There we go. Okay, we'll take those. Uh, there's Big Mama's foot down there. Um. Hmm. I'm wondering if we could take advantage of. Uh, this upper area here. I think though that this block, if we step on it, it's going to collapse. Oh, never mind. No, it won't. What about that one, I wonder? Alright, let's try something here. Ooh. 
Well, we woke him up. This might hurt us a little bit. Yeah, 1,200 XP. I was going to say, he's got to be feral. And this big mama probably is, too. Yep, 1,200 XP. All right, we got him. Very nice. Very nice indeed. I guess that zombo outside is probably just a... Outside zombie. paper. What in the hell is going on over here? <laughs> Quit your racket. What do we got? Let's repair this and get rid of that. <coughs> get rid of that. Get rid of the cloth. Get rid of the sand. <coughs> um. Those. Nice. That gives us a fourth wheel, which means we can, I'm not going to take that. We can make, uh, we have enough wheels to make a four by four. All right, let's see here. I don't want to come back in here. Not that that's that big of a deal, but I really don't. So what we're going to do is we're going to put that in there and take those. We might be able to put that on something. Um, here, maybe. So it's got cooling and heating. Okay. Take shock and parts. I'm not really too worried about the buckshot and the iron crossbow bolts. We can make those, but I don't want to leave ammunition behind. We can get corn easily enough. And I think... One pumpkin isn't really that important. There, we're going to call it good. All right. Let's go do our turning. How do I get the hell out of here? This way. Hi, Jen. So, what are you buying today? Congratulations. Ooh. I can make my payment to the Duke now. Look at that. A green ratchet. Or nine millimeter weapons degrade 20% slower. I think I want to go with the green ratchet. That was a nice reward. Um, all right, jobs. You have another infested clear. You have two infested clears. What's this? You know, I Shamway. Let's do it. Hard work. Do hurry. I have a protection payment coming up soon. Okay. T take a look at your inventory. I want to sell you this. And eh, we could get a few more coins if we fix that all the way up, but it's good enough, I think. already have one of these. We'll sell her that. She can have this. And, um, yeah, that was a really nice find. I was about ready to make a green wrench, too, so now we don't have to. Okay, I think that's all we're going to sell her. And uh, she will reset tomorrow on day 28, which is also Horde Day. Okay. Thank you so much. You're welcome Come so again. much. All right, guys, we're going to wrap up the episode here. And uh, 
what we'll probably do is start the next episode and we'll do that uh, Shamway. That's not the Shamway factory, mind you. It's probably just the Shamway POI. <coughs> Excuse me. Um, yeah, in the start of the next episode. So thanks, everybody, for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed the episode. And if you did, please hit that like button and subscribe to the channel. Leave a comment and share out the video. And we'll catch you all in the next episode. Bye-bye.